Ibiza, woo! Manchester to Ibiza, <laughs> yes, then out of way. That's not the, that's not the words. <laughs> Manchester to Ibiza. Manchester to Ibiza. Tonight we're gonna get on the floor. I love when that's the words, but okay. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Mads. If you're new here, which if you are, please make sure to subscribe. And if you are one of my babes, one of my OGs, then thank you so much for being here. Once again with your girl Mads. What's new? We've got a PLT haul. I am obsessed with PLT at the minute, as you guys probably already know. <laughs> this is the thing, I'm doing a haul today and I've made another order this morning. What is wrong with me? So if you want to see a part two, then make sure to comment down below that you want to see one, give it a big thumbs up, all that jazz, you know. I feel like I've done this intro for a PLT haul so many times, so I think we should just get straight into it because... <laughs> I'm obsessed with PLT, I'm obsessed with doing hauls, I love spending my money, what's new? If you see anything in the background moving, it's just Patrick, sorry about that, he's refusing to leave me alone, he's been a bit needy today. <laughs> so I thought I would start off with something I have been obsessed with and I have got so many questions on. I actually wore these last week for Park Life, which is why they're a little bit dirty, I'm not going to lie. But they are these, what, are they, what were they called? They weren't cargo, were they? I think they were, oh yeah they were! Okay, so these cargo shorts and I am obsessed with the material. I love the design of them and they are so flattering. With the belt, with the little pockets, I just thought they were so cute for park life and they'll be really good for summer and holidays and everything like that. So the material is quite thin so it's nice and loose, it's really comfortable and yeah, I just really liked the theme of the shop, wait, wait, the theme, the style, that's what I was going with. <laughs> so they're like a beige colour and then they have black detail, black, black and gold detail I'd say. So they've got a black and gold belt which I just thought was a really cute little touch. You can also just take this belt out and wear your own belt which I like as well. It's got a little button and then the pockets just look like this. So they've got two pockets on either leg. I think oh, the real pockets as well. Why did I not make the most of that? Yeah, I'm obsessed with them. Such a cute little short. And I did actually get these in a size six. <laughs> can't remember how much they were though. I can't remember how much most products were. So I'll leave everything in the description box so you guys can just go and check them out yourselves. So is bought that. Wait, I've not left space for a try-on clip. I'll sit over this way so I can pop the try-on clip here. So the next piece I picked up isn't very me, but I thought it'd be so cute in summertime to go for drinks, even just during the day. And it's this little midi skirt and I am obsessed with it. So it just looks like this. It's just, like I said, a cream midi skirt, I guess. And then it's also got this frill detailing. So I think, is it called asymmetric when it's like... I think it is asymmetric, so it kind of goes like up your leg a little bit and yeah it's like a ribbed material obviously bodycon and it's super flattering on you guys are going to see on the try and clip anyway I just thought that with this little bandeau top would be so cute this is also PLT I didn't buy it in this shopping trip this haul you know what I mean I've had this a while but I just thought this and this together would look really cute. So I got the skirt in a size 6 but I would probably go a size up in this just because it's so tight like literally getting it on was the struggle of my life. So next I've got another skirt and if you guys have been following me for a while you guys will already know I'm not a skirt kind of girl but I'm trying to change my ways. I've seen a lot of skirts recently and I've been loving them so I thought I'd pick this one up as well. I'm really hit and miss with camo but I just thought because it's quite subtle and I really liked the colours of it I thought it'd be quite cute with some trainers and a little crop top. So I think it is an airline skirt but you know I don't really know. But yeah I just thought in summertime it's a cute little skirt, you can wear it on holiday, you can wear it in England for the English summer you know with some trainers and anything like that and I also like that it's got a like loophole for belts just because I like to snatch my waist in you guys already know this so I like really snatching my waist in with a belt so yeah just thought this was super cute and I got this in a size 6 as well I think I got everything in a size 6 so I can probably stop saying that <laughs> oh I wore these already I tried them on with fake tan on and I've got fake tan on them 
<laughs> I also picked up these white floaty shorts and I've been looking for a pair of perfect white shorts. I say perfect because I feel like with white shorts you can be very hit or miss. These ones were a hit but you can, yeah. I think these were in the petite sh section. I hate my life. I think these were in the petite section which I wasn't really sure why because they don't look petite. I mean they're quite long shorts so yeah I would recommend even if you're not petite but yeah they've just got an elasticated waist with a little drawstring and they're just super super floaty I love the material of them they're so soft and I just thought these would be nice for around the pool on holiday on the beach you can even wear them in England I don't know why I'm talking like this so I just think little things like this are staple for summer because you can wear them with so many different outfits you can wear them day or night and they were really cheap as well so extra happy mads. <laughs> Next I picked up a bikini and this is the bikini of all bikinis. This is the bikini of summer 18. I am obsessed with it. I think Patrick doesn't like it but I don't care because babes this is a nice bikini. I would never ever ever usually have picked up something like this but oh, this year I'm all about gold and I want to shine babe. This is the cutest bikini ever, so it's kind of like a gold sparkly, I don't even think the camera is picking this up, but even in person, the gold reflects and it sparkles and you shine into the moon, the people on the moon, hello people. So it is just a triangle bikini top and like I said, it's gold, it's glittery and I friggin love it. I like these straps on bikinis as well, I think they're really flattering and they're really easy to wear for whatever shape or size you are. But yeah, that is the bikini top and then I also bought the bottoms to match. I thought these were just really, 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 really long, but apparently you can tie these lacy bits up your body as well, which I thought was cute. I don't know whether I'll do that. I think I'll probably just wear them like tied to the side, but I liked that they were super high-waisted. You know I love high-waisted things. It's really flattering on my body. Really, really cute bikini. I'm going to wear this in Ibiza, which I booked. We finally booked Ibiza in August, no they said October, August, Ibiza. <laughs> so I have been on the leopard print hype for like six months and I finally decided I needed some leopard print pants, trousers, whatever you want to call them. And I picked these ones up from Pretty Little Thing and I am so obsessed with them. So they're just wide legged, kind of like a satin feel and then they've got this white piping down the side. So cute for summer, obsessed with leopard print and I just thought they'd look really cool in the evening or even during the day with some trainers or sandals. And yeah, they're super high waisted and that's about it. <laughs> this with a cute little black bikini top, I'm done. <laughs> So next I picked up this little cropped shirt and I've been seeing this everywhere and I finally decided it was time to get my own. So yeah, it's just this cropped little shirt and I really like the shape of it because it kind of like comes down here and then it's backless at the back with this little detail right here. I really loved the material of it, I love the colour, I love how it's kind of smart but casual at the same time. And I just thought this would look cute for dinner or lunch anything like that. I wouldn't really say this is a summery piece but it kind of is because it's cropped I guess but I just needed it. It's so cute. I also just picked up a black mid-axi skirt. This is from the Second Skin collection situation and I've already got one of these in beige and I'm obsessed with it. I wear it quite a lot. You can wear it with so many different things that's the best thing about it. I can wear it with trainers or heels in the evening. I love them. So I thought I would get one in black and I have such a cute outfit for this. I'm not going to tell you because I'm going to wear it tonight. But I've got such a cute outfit for it and yeah, I just love how long it is. The material on it is so beautiful. It's like double layered so it's not see through in the slightest and like I said, you can wear these in so many different ways. I think this in the summer with a little crop top and trainers, denim jacket, good to go. Again, I got this in a size 6. I do like these really nice and tight. I think they're really flattering on your figure. And yeah, that's about it. I also picked up this top, which, oh gosh, I've worn it and it's really, really dirty. I also picked up this off-the-shoulder black slinky ruched top. And I actually wore this in my last video and got so many questions about it. So it's from PLT, everyone wondering, hello. So it's just got long sleeves, obviously it's black, and then it's got this ruched detail in the middle, which I just think is really cute. It's really hard to show on camera, but you'll see on the try and clip just how beautiful it is. And I thought with the skirt that I've just shown you, or with a pair of joggers, anything like that, this would be really, really lovely. I think pieces like this, black, white, 
or cream, anything like that, go really well with so many different things. So these are like little staples in your wardrobe, you know? I'm gonna show these together because they're really basic little things that I picked up, but basics are staples, you know? So I just picked up this cream bandeau. I thought this would be nice with a skirt or jeans or joggers, anything like that. And they're really easy to style with a little jacket over the top. Just really, really basic little bandeau, you know. And then I also picked up this crop top from the Second Skin Collection again. And I am obsessed with this kind of neck at the minute. So it's like a sporty, like, is it racer? Racer neck? I don't really know, but I'm obsessed with this kind of neck anyway, and it's cropped. Really cute colour, again, another staple to wear with so many different things, and yeah. I picked up something else from the petite section, and let me just say, these are not petite, because they came past my feet. But I think even with heels, these would be borderline too long. I also picked up these black satin trousers and I'm obsessed with satin at the minute. I, you guys probably already know this, but obsessed with satin. I think it looks so beautiful, especially against like really nice jewellery and things like that. So these have just got an elasticated waist, which I really liked because I feel like it makes them not as dressy if you know what I mean. It kind of makes them more casual. And then they are also wide-legged and like I said, they are quite long. But I thought these with a crop top, trainers, denim jacket, you're good to go. I always think trousers like this are perfect for summer because they're really loose, really comfortable. But yeah, obsessed with these and I've got so many outfits in my head for them. So I'm excited to try these with a lot of different things. Okay, so I am all about these three quarter length shorts. Are they th they're not even called that, are they? You know which ones I mean, the longer shorts. I am living for them. But I feel like they're sold out everywhere or they're really expensive. The ones I've been looking at are really expensive. So I thought I would make my own. Oh yeah. And I didn't want them like skinny jeans. I wanted them quite baggy. I've seen a picture of Kim Kardashian and she's got the kind of like mum jeans but cropped and I was obsessed with them. So I actually picked up a pair of white mum jeans from Pretty Little Thing and I cut them myself. Yep. Yeah. I'm brave, I know. I feel like I'm a genius at this now. I've done this with a few of them and I'm obsessed. So yeah, they're just the basic white mom jeans. Mom jeans, wow, who am I? Mom jeans from PLT. And I think they were about 20 pounds, so they're really inexpensive. And then I just cut them myself. And let me just say, I'm so impressed with myself. Like I tried these on and they were exactly how I wanted them to look. So I think I'm gonna buy a few more pairs of jeans and do this myself because you can get them to the length you want. You can get the style of jean you like, and yeah, this is a genius idea of mine that everyone's probably already doing, but I think I'm doing something new. <laughs> I also really want to see what the casual joggers will look like crops. If you don't know about PLT's casual joggers, where have you been? I'm actually wearing them right now as well. These are the comfiest most beautiful joggers on the planet. They're so flattering on your figure because they've got a drawstring, they sit really nicely on the waist, they've got so many beautiful colours and they're just the comfiest things you will ever put on your body, ever. But I'm thinking, what would these look like if I cut them into little, like, shorts? I might try that. I will leave the joggers in the description box too just because if you don't know about them, you need to get to know about them. I wear them all the time. Last but not least, going back in with the leopard print theme, I thought I would pick up this little jacket. I'm trying to think. I think it's a biker, biker jacket, that's the one. So it's a biker jacket. And I love the detail on it with the belt at the bottom. It's just got a zip, it's got a zip at the front as well. And yeah, for summer, this is so perfect. Love this material, by the way. It's like a suede material, which is so soft and beautiful. This will go with so many outfits in summer. I just think it's the perfect summer jacket, especially with me loving leopard print at the minute. If you guys love leopard print, type it in on PLT, and there's so many different things at the minute that are absolutely stunning. This was one of them, and I'm completely obsessed with it. I actually got this in a size 10, just because I do like my jackets nice and oversized, and it fits like, a dream. I also forgot to mention, when do I ever do a PLT haul without buying sunglasses? So I actually got two pairs and I am so obsessed with them. I have been wearing them non-stop and I kind of need to stop. I kind of need to chill. So these are the first ones and they're just all black cat eye sunglasses. Really, really skinny as well, which I like. And these on the gram, 
a bougie AF. I'm so excited to wear these. And I also picked these ones up, which are my favourite sunglasses of all time. I've had these before, and then Patrick ran over them in his car. By accident, of course. We wasn't in a domestic. But I bought them again, and they're just a gold fl flame. They're just a gold frame with black lenses. Obsessed with them. Bougie. I know. Amazing. I know. So guys, that was everything I've been buying from PLT at the minute. Actually, no, it's not because I've got a PLT order coming tomorrow. Very excited about this. But that is everything I got recently and yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you got some inspo. I know you guys like seeing these kind of videos. So if you want to see another PLT haul next week, then make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. And if you're not already, please subscribe. All the products I have talked about will be listed in the description. I can't say that. Description box. There we go. As always, let me know in the comment section which pieces were your favourites. And yeah, I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.